Guys, it might already be Sonic Movie 3 trailer season. Hey, what's up everyone? It's me, Speezy for Zombie, guys, another video. In this video today, we are back again talking once again about Sonic Movie 3. For real, this time, it's not April 1st today. We're done with that stuff. And while this video isn't necessarily a news video, because there isn't really, like, news coming out of this, this might come as news to some of you. And this is really more of a discussion piece, something to kind of get a conversation going, because something very big and significant is coming up this upcoming week that could have massive implications for the Sonic the Hedgehog Movie 3 in particular. Now, you might be saying, what's coming up, Ricardo? Well, it's something that we've talked about on the channel at least a few times, and that is CinemaCon. If you guys don't know what CinemaCon is, it's this massive event that takes place in Las Vegas, I believe, each year, where basically all of the movie studios, the major movie studios like Disney, Warner Bros, Paramount, think of all of the major ones, they show up there, and it's really basically this insider convention, if you will, to basically show movie theaters in particular what they have to look forward to in terms of upcoming films for this particular calendar year. In 2019, I believe, it could have been 2018, Paramount actually had a big Sonic presence at CinemaCon that year. This was heavily documented, they had a few trailers play that's now kind of considered lost media. Sonic 2, I believe, was mentioned in passing, but due to timing, I wasn't really able to have a massive focus at CinemaCon that year, but Sonic Movie 3 got mentioned last CinemaCon, although briefly, it did get a good reaction from the overall audience. But with CinemaCon coming at this time, in this particular time in the year, I feel like we're bound to not only hear about Sonic Movie 3, in fact, I can guarantee we're going to hear about Sonic Movie 3, but we're here to talk about the potential of a trailer and what footage could be shown off for it, if any. So let's talk about this real quick. What are the things that point towards a Sonic Movie 3 trailer happening? Well, first things first, the most important thing is the fact that the movie is wrapped. And while yes, there might be reshoots later down the line and stuff like that, the main production is done. We're now in the post-production stages of things. In fact, they've probably been working on the post-production for this movie for a while. Lines are being recorded, animations being done. We're getting closer and closer to this thing, you know, being out. We're almost not halfway through the year, but you know, we're chugging along. We're now in April. That is something that is very positive. If this thing was in the middle of shooting still, then I would highly doubt that there'd be any form of footage or stuff that could be shown off for the film there. But with the movie being wrapped, I think this adds a likelihood to it. And while yes, the movie has just recently wrapped, but we heard from James Marsden that they wrapped like a few weeks beforehand. So there's a good chance that it's been wrapped longer than we've known publicly for. But you never know, they might need more time to assemble a proper trailer. As we know right now, there has been no marketing or teases or anything like that in relation to Sonic Movie 3 or a trailer coming out at CinemaCon. You know, sometimes companies will do that. Like for example, this new Joker 2 poster just got revealed and they said you know new trailer coming out around this time which is going to be during Warner Brothers CinemaCon kind of starting the marketing rollout so they can time it with CinemaCon Paramount has not done that for Sonic Movie 3 yet I believe if they're going to do something in relation to Sonic 3 such as a trailer I feel like we'd have other news by now this means not only a look at Shadow but also the announcement of who's going to be playing him like we had the announcement of Feature Salva long before the trailer came out for it but also I think the most important thing is that, like the Joker situation, Paramount does put out a poster beforehand. Like for Sonic Movie 2, they gave us our first poster, our first look at the film, and also gave us a date for the trailer's release, which was at the Game Awards. You never know, maybe once when this weekend is done, they'll drop a poster and be like, trailer coming out in a few days for Sonic Movie 3. That'd be very exciting. But I just don't think the timeline is just there in lining up really for a publicly revealed trailer. So this is the other end of things. I think there's a chance that footage or looks at Sonic Movie 3 and info on Sonic Movie 3 will be given at CinemaCon because this, at this point, I think is Paramount's biggest release of the year left so far. I could be mistaken, maybe there's something I'm not privy to right now that is much larger than Sonic 3 that other people are really hyped for that's coming from Paramount, but I think Sonic 3 is Paramount's like big blockbuster thing of the year, so this is what they're going to want to hype up for the theaters. Once again, this is meant to show off to theater chains what they have to look forward to in 20 2024. If this is your biggest thing in 2024, you kind of have to show some stuff off in relation to it. Now, I should note, not everything gets out into the public. Obviously, like I mentioned earlier in the video, the first Sonic movie got its first footage shown off at CinemaCon. Did we see that hit the public? No. In fact, now, like I said, it's kind of considered lost media. We might not ever see that. But descriptions could get out from CinemaCon, a bunch of info that they list off, new details might get out from CinemaCon. But I think maybe another approach that they could take in terms of promoting
promoting Sonic 3 because I feel like they have to. We will be hearing news next week in relation to the film. And this is the one that might be able to hit the hardest. We're on the CinemaCon stage. It's Paramount's panel. It's time to talk about Sonic 3. We don't got any footage to show off. They might bring out Jeff Fowler to talk about the movie a bit, some of the producers, and they might let us know while we got no footage to show off. We do have something pretty significant to tell you guys about the film, and that's who's playing Shadow the Hedgehog. What I'd do is I'd have that person flown out, step right onto that stage, say hello, talk about Shadow for a bit, what the character means to them, why they want to play the character. It'll set the internet ablaze, photos will be released, it'll be a big moment. I think that is probably one of the best ways you can go about it. Then follow up with like, you know, social media posts from that actor, whoever it may be. I know people's minds are going rampant with possible actors. Is it going to be Keanu Reeves? Is it going to be Robert Pattinson? Is it going to be whoever? I know people are really pushing for Jason Griffith. That's just not going to happen. <laughs> I think this would be an awesome move, a massive move for the Sonic movie in a way of making waves at CinemaCon without having to show footage. They might show looks, maybe they have some screenshots they can show off, some concept art, some things that might be able to even be shown to us. Overall, that's my prediction. Next week, stay tuned. We will be getting Sonic the Hedgehog Movie 3 news at CinemaCon. They'll at least talk about it because if it gets mentioned last year, they're definitely going to talk about it this year. But in terms of a trailer hitting the internet that we're going to be able to watch, react to, all of that, the marketing has just not lined up for that yet. We're still a few months away, I think at least a month. Like I said, Shadow in the announcement of his actor, I feel is the first domino that has to fall. Then we can start getting into actual marketing material like posters and trailers and teasers and what have you. Although this year is flying by, we are still in April and this movie releases in December. We're still more than half a year away from this thing. So we do got some time, but regardless, like I said, we will be seeing something next week. Whether it hits the internet, whether it doesn't, whether it's footage that is shown off there that's exclusive or not, there's still a lot of stuff that needs to happen with this movie. It seems like they've just got actors in booths recording lines, a lot of stuff. But the one thing you're going to want to do is stay tuned to this channel for everything in relation to this. Not a lot of people on the internet right now are talking about the possibility of this or almost the certainty of Sonic Movie 3 news coming next week. So to be the first ones to hear about anything in relation to this film or really anything in Sonic the Hedgehog in general make sure you're subscribed to the channel have your notification bell on and just you know join our family here because this is going to be massive but this is where I pass it off to you guys and ask what you think what do you think the chances are that we will be seeing a Sonic the Hedgehog movie 3 trailer or any piece of marketing material really whether that's Shadow's actor being brought out on stage or little concept arch things being shown off or what have you let me know what you're thinking in the comments I love to know what you guys have to say free free to follow my social media links to my Twitter and Instagram in the description below you can follow those buying things in my life future content and all things Sonic the Hedgehog but most importantly if you're not subscribed make sure you're subscribed like I said we're the best place on YouTube for all things Sonic, whether it's video games, TV shows, movies, combos, merchandise, and more, we talk about it all, not just with this coming up next week, but in general Sonic Movie 3. We're going to be talking about every little thing that comes out in relation to it, but not just that. The Knuckles show is only a few weeks away. I cannot wait for that show. Also, games are right around the corner with Sonic X Shadow Generation, Sonic Toys Party, a bunch of other stuff. It's been an amazing time to be a Sonic fan recently, and I can't wait for you guys to join us on this journey. I love all you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Right by the motherfucking seaside, dog Everything I see, I got a dream I thought these leaves are going to take me out the dark I know everything I wanted to find away